from Muppet Baby's Classic Children's Tales, retold by Louise Gekow, illustrated by Tom Brannon, and art direction by Lauren Antonello. Robin Hood by Paul Creswick. Many years ago, when good King Henry II and Queen Eleanor ruled England, a forest named Sherwood near the town of Nottingham was set aside for the king's hunting. No one except the king could kill a deer in Sherwood Forest. Robin Fitztooth grew up near Sherwood. Robin, his cousin Will, and their friend Marion played happily there in the clear air beneath the green trees. When Robin was a young man, the sheriff of Nottingham announced there would be an archery contest. Robin decided to go to Nottingham to try for the prize. Then, as he was walking through the forest, he came upon some of the king's foresters. You plan to compete in an archery contest with those toy arrows? laughed one. They are not toys! Robin angrily replied, I will show you! And without thinking, he pulled out his bow, took an arrow from his quill, and shot the best deer in a nearby herd. Do you know what you have done? shouted the forester. You have killed one of the king's deers. By law of the land, you are an outlaw. Catch him! shouted another. But Robin had grown up in the forest, and none knew it as well as he. He easily avoided his pursuers, and from that day on, he lived as an outlaw in Sherwood Forest. In Sherwood, Robin met with other men who had been labeled outlaws, men who were not liked by the Sheriff of Nottingham. They were merry, though, and they spent their time robbing from the rich and greedy friends of the Sheriff, then giving their gold and silver pieces to the poor. Most people came to love Robin and his outlaw friends, but the Sheriff of Nottingham was filled with anger. The sheriff was determined to capture the young outlaw, so he decided to trick him. He announced another archery contest with a golden arrow as the prize. He knew that Robin would surely come to compete, and when he did, the sheriff could easily arrest him. But Robin cleverly disguised himself in an old hood and cloak, completely fooling the sheriff, and won the golden arrow. Because of his disguise, he was known ever after as Rob in the Hood, or Robin Hood, the end.